So here are some of the items that you will need for this project. You'll need liquid stitch, fabric, scissors, needle and thread, pins, pin cushion. You'll need sheep appliques or felt pieces and I had made these on my Cricut machine but I linked down below some Etsy sites where I think that you could find really cute sheep appliques. So starting off we're going to cut equal parts fabric and AC more is great because you can get scraps of fabric for really cheap and they have nice pieces of fabric and make sure to never uh, leave the house without coupons. So I'm just going to be pinning this all the way around. And just make sure that you leave enough space um, so you can stuff it after we're done sewing it. So now we're going to sew our pillows. This is the fun part and I am not an expert seamstress or sewer by any means but I do my best in sewing as straight of a line as I possibly can. So now you're going to turn your pillow inside out. So now you're just going to get your sheep appliques and your letters and then you're just going to position on the pillow where you would like them to go. And I tried to make it as close to the way the Pottery Barn pillow was. So now you're going to take your liquid stitch. And we're going to start to glue our first sheep, our U. So instead of just going all over the um, felt piece, because if I did that, like you could see through um, the felt piece that where the glue was. So I just decided it'd be better just to go all the way around the edge. So you're just going to do the exact same thing with your other sheep and then your letters. You're just going to position them where you want and um, press down, hold down so that it adheres to your fabric.
So after it's stuffed, you're just going to sew the rest up. And here is your pillow. And I love how this turned out. It's really close to the original pillow. Um, and I did it for a fraction of the cost. And I just love how it turned out. So I thought it would be fun to kind of um, match that pillow and I used some Dollar Tree glass paint in black and white because I wanted to test this out and see how it worked and also Dollar Tree glass mugs. And I think it turned out really well. It matches the pillow great and I think that the Dollar Tree glass paint works well. So I hope you guys really liked this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.